Yeah, they don't know you, yes, but not today. Yes, book. Hello, good afternoon, and thank you for joining us here at the St. Elizabeth Technical Sports Complex. It's the second meet meeting between these two teams, Lakova in their blue and white. Yeah. This team in their yellow top and blue shorts with yellow socks. St. Elizabeth Technical Sports Complex is the venue. It's a must win for both teams. Lakovia, they are on 10 points. The Stets team, they are on 13 points in a pole position to qualify for the Inter zone. And the Lakovia team, they need all three points in order to secure a place in the Inter zone round. And uh, it's, a, it's not too hot today cool conditions, kind of warm in Santa Cruz, while it's testing they already and are set to take on this clash, the Lakota team I'm sure coach Fitzroy Ambersley will have a, a, a good game plan to approach this team, this game, while it's test team they, they know that they need a point or need all three points. Hello, good afternoon, and thank you for joining us here on Gold Buster and Sports Note. I am Gold Buster, and I will be here with you throughout the duration of this game. The Lakota team, Dwayne Ball, number 10, Rajen Legor, Jamal Wright, who had two goals against Monroe. Nikoi Goldburn had a, had a good game against Monroe College in their 2 1 um, victory. Trayvon Dunkley, number six, he will be inspirational in the middle of the park for the Lakota team. Shaquino Campbell, number eight, Javani Stone. Danny Walker, who starts today for the Lakota unit. Daniel Webb, Dan J. Rowe, and uh, Kimarley Myers completes the starting lineup for the Lakota unit. While the test team, they made one change to their, their team that one over BB Coke 3 2 on Wednesday. Nigo Staley came in for for absentee Hendrix. So he will start today. Nigo Staley, number 20, will start for. The five time champions today, Dante Campbell, Christopher Roy, who came off against BB Coke. He back into the starting team. It was a close one when he came off against BB Coke on Wednesday. But he's a fit and ready for today. That's Christopher Roy. Tyree Stoddart, the left fullback player, having a good tournament so far. Shamar German, who came in last Wednesday and really applied himself well into the right fullback position. Really a very important player to this unit. Nicardo Simit, one to watch, a very competent midfielder, visionary, he likes to take the pace of the ball, a good hard a tackler, and a player that definitely is needed if Stets to should win this novel coronavirus the Costa Cup competition. Michael German, who had the first goal against BB Coke, wonderful glancing header, is uh, up front today. Zamario Douglas, the player who had the winner against BB Coke on a Wednesday, is a fit and ready to go. Romel Wellington 
keep his place inside the cage. Ajay Simit, who moves into the middle of the park today to apply himself into a central midfield role. He's a, a flank player, very dangerous flank player, but he has been dragged into the middle due to the absence of captain Chadwick Hendricks. Rohane Brown, the inspirational player, a player that will definitely take the test team home in any situation. So that's the starting lineup for both teams, Stets team, Lakovi team in their blue and white. Here they are on the ball. They try to get that one across from. Brown, interception, Brown. German, and they're trying to find a needle stay. Was in the car, that was in it. Very tame start to the game. My both coaches have been total awareness of and the total respect for each other and uh, they will definitely be setting aside their differences today Fitzroy Ambersley the coach of Fitzroy Ambersley the head coach of Lakovia he definitely will Definitely wanting to get all three points here. You, you can see the the game plan. They are sitting deep and they're waiting on the counter attack. Both teams apply the, their formation, 4-4-2 formation. By that number number four, Giovanni Stone, and the number thirteen, Danje Rowe who will. Danje Rowe will definitely be holding the, the defensive third of the Lakova unit. Zamario Douglas to Nigos German. Michael German here is Zamario Douglas now. And it's still there, goalkeeper. Take it now for the Stets team because they it over it. Blow that one at the back post. Still inside the danger here, Rahim Brown. Back to Nicardo Simic. We play that one wide. And the Negroes daily get there, yes, he does. That's a deep little section. Goal kick coming up. So a very tame start to the game. And a luck over team. Fix by Ambersley. Head coach Anthony Nelson, physio Oscar Bailey, team manager, assistant coaches Richard and Emard, assistant physio Gregory Marvin. Head coach, vibrant head coach, Amar Rambo Hedebrand, Dave and Dave Dennis, first assistant, Brandon Gale, second assistant, Ron Thomas, physical trainer, Leon Hansen, team manager. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Oh. 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 Oh.
No nonsense, midfielder. That pass. Ball. Daniel Webb is caught into the offside. Chop. Not a physical start today for the game. It came as if both teams are playing for a, a point. And, uh, Myers finding it hard to clear his lines. He is German. Ajay Sinek, force wide. And German is bundled over with. He's back up and ready. Ball played inside. It's a steam in possession. German controlling his chest. In the lost position. It's their steam. All they have to do is avoid a defeat here. They're in pole position to move on to the interzone round. But they have to avoid a defeat. And even if they are defeated, they have to be aware of the margin of defeat. A 3-0 margin and and one more win. And the Legor misses. Here's the header now. And the 1-0, Michael German. After a mistake of from... It's over the top. Michael German misses from five yards out after a mistake from goalkeeper Legor. But Myers, the fact that seems to be Giovanni Stone, who is down. But Michael German with a perfect opportunity. I thought it was in the back of the net. And Michael German should have put that one away. So a German missed that opportunity, open net, and he had that one over the top. It's the first chance of the game for the Sets team. And you have to be aware of your chances. You have to take them. You have to take them. When you get your chances, take them. So goalkeeper Rajan Legor let that goal, let that ball out of his hands just now. But I'm sure, I'm sure he will make amends. And the Stoddart could keep that one in play. Okay, go fix that now. And uh, Webb, number 14, Daniel Webb. Yeah, yeah. He's a very adamant about his. Eagles, Zamaria Douglas. So if you can see you over the over the mountains are uh, dark clouds piling up. So we're looking for rain later. 
Monroe they will tackle BB Coke. Later on. And across at the back post, no one is there. Rohan Brown who got a knock. Jamal Wright, who has to be careful. Right. Here we go. Campbell. Stone. Myers. And a ball for the chase of Trayvon Dunkley, who is uh, playing a higher role today. So, Trayvon Dunkley and Ramon Wright are playing the attacking role. Two dangerous players, always having good collaborations. There's a ball. Javon Duncan. Webb. Webb on to Jamal Wright and caught into the offside again. So he has to be aware of the line that the Stets team are applying. And uh, Dante Campbell is on the ball now, wearing the captain's armband today for the Stets team. Very competent young player. Winning the Under-16 Championships 2019. Also the All-Island Championship. That seems to be a corner kick, the first corner of the game. Nigo Staley couldn't take that one on the first attempt. <laughs> well, let me thank you again for making it call Buster Sport Note. YouTube page. Steps. YouTube page. Thank you for making it here. And the goalkeeper comes and had a touch to that one. And Fifi Terrence there from Javon Stone. There is ball. Over the top there, Trayvon Dunkley is onside. The goalkeeper comes. Webb. And then Allen. Track number nine. German. Goldburn. So Nikoi Goldburn, who applied it to the left side, left midfield role for the Lakova team. Migos. Daily, nice touch. Put that one inside. Rohan Brown. Back to German. Can he keep the one in place? So it's not a matter of settling in the game. It's a matter of keeping possession of the ball, which is a plague to both teams right now to keep possession. <laughs> And not giving away the ball too easily. You 
have to be aware of Samo. the danger of Michael German, the danger of Zamari or Douglas. And the fitness of Rohane Brown. While on the other hand, Trayvon Dunklin, number six for Yakovia, very competent player, dangerous player when he's on the ball, and also also Jamal Wright, number seven, who had two goals against Monroe College on Wednesday. Has potential to find the goal at any moment and the player has goal burn. The player on the ball has ball. He's down, free kick here for the luck of the team and the doing ball definitely the last year for doing ball. So he needs to make a point, prove a point. And, uh, needs to make his presence the fact here. Here we go. Taking shot. Here is a donkey. Stone over the top. We need to put reflection there. Second the corner for the Stets team. So now the Stets team there, they're piling up some pressure on the right hand side. They're attacking the right hand side, which is Lakovia's is the left side. Two Myers, number two. So they're finding that point as the weak point. Not a good corner. Dunkley will get there. Trying to back heel that one. German take too long, allowing Dunkley to recover. Now here is a Jamal Wright. Trying to go through the middle. Zamari. That's Nigos Daily. Nice touch. Oh, that's a clumsy tackle. This should be and uh, no card. So, referee Marquino, referee Marquino Brown is in a good mood today. Keep your right, Marcia. Keep it cool. All right, so we are back, facing some technical difficulties just now. So we are back live at the St. Louisville Technical Sports Complex. So water break call. All right, so we'll come back after the after, after the water break. And that's this they had a corner just now, and the result in a handball. But brilliant move here for the Lakota team, and yet again caught into the offside. So the Lakota team they are not watching their the lines of. This test defense. Trayvon Duncan. In and out conditions here. In and out conditions at the center of the technical sports complex. Dunk is Trayvon Jamal Wright and uh, Illegally says the referee free kick here for the lock over unit. And the first time these two teams met. Right in the first goal, but you see Stets had the better of the two goals. Two one. Energy. Stets go. Energy. Energy. No, that's why you blow. And look what me attacking. The first one. I see him. So row. One goes right up. Step up to take this one. Big central defender. 
play that one short, intercepted by Brown. Here's a potential counter-attack. German is on that right-hand side. Oh, that's a nice ball to German. German take that one, and that should be a call. Let's see the decision from the referee here. And a yellow card is their decision. But Michael German, though, that was a lovely ball from Zamario Douglas. Michael German took it on his chest in his stride. And a good tackle there from number five, Danique Walker. <laughs> so free kick now for the test team in a very interesting area and the man is over it that's a Rohan Brown I always say that Rohan Brown once you get the ball over the wall it will hit the back of the net let's see if my words can be true here today 0-0 zero, zero is the scoreline Samara Douglas is also there Rohan Brown Oh, and the Rohan Brown, his guys are one Here we go It's a nice touch and they're looking for a chase of Ramon, right? But Dante Campbell is always there. Good defender. He will have a good profile. Here he is again. And a exciting defender is uh, Dante Campbell. Coming up through the ranks of on the 14s, on the 16s. Stoddard. And the Goldberg. Lakovia. He's all alone on that right hand side. Buster Sports now, YouTube page. It's German. Still German. He has two players inside. Oh, he tried to find Zamara Douglas, put it back to German. German having a second chance at the cherry. Rohan Brown. Out wide. And they couldn't keep that one in play. Michael German, though. You have to settle as a striker. Get the ball under control. Find a pass. Ensure that your pass is in line. Can't be giving away position all the time. So the conditions is hot, but you can see on the clothes, dark clothes, and it's too direct from uh, Stoddart. And the moment, the moment, the moment you, the moment you're on the field and your teammates are trying to tell you the right thing and you're acting as if 
you were doing the right thing, when you know that you you weren't doing the right thing. That's the sign of weakness. You can lose concentration by by doing just that. Indeed. Here we go, and Douglas is off the park, but he looks to be okay. Game continues. No, 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 no. No real spark to this game. Both teams are giving away possession. But here is Lakoga now and uh, Christopher Roy will get a. No, no. And Marquino. Christopher Roy got a, got a red card. He, he wasn't the last man back. And Marquino Brown has given Christopher Roy a red card. Red card right there is not, not, not even a warning. He wasn't the last man. The player was far away from goal. It wasn't inside the box. And Marquino gave, gave, gave the player a red card. He's, he's in charge of. He's in charge of the game. He's in charge of the game, but but that red card to me was not the right decision from the referee. So the test team they're down to ten men early in the in the, in the, in the first half. So a, a long way to go, and the lack of a team is zero zero here. And the lock of the team in with a uh, advantage is Campbell. And uh, now the lock of the team they they can take full advantage. This test team they they had a player sent off on Wednesday against BB Cole. But I see him thing. Making around. Now they are down again, but this time it's earlier in the game. And a red card there from Marquina Brown and a, a, lot of, a lot of talkings, a lot of talking going around. Brown. And the card. There is a shot now. He took a dipper, but wide off target from. Jamal right. So the lock over team they are in with a advantage now. This test team again. They're down to ten players. And central central defender Christopher Roy is a casualty this time and was uh, Hendricks. On Wednesday now is Christopher Roy and he will miss the game in the second round in the, in the zone. So. Yes, they have it to do here again. Let's see if they can repeat. So here is again. Resumption. This team they are down to nine players at the moment. As uh, Shemar German is off receiving treatment. This team they, they know how to apply themselves when they are down player strategically and tactically here is a German nice take and Campbell clear his lines there's a ball over the top of the chase of Donkey and a one into the afternoon sky and it seems as if the, the, the coaches are are the one that are that is that is roughing the game because every time the coach 
remonstrate with the referee. He and it look it look as if German will not continue. So Jeffrey Henry is a summon. Like for like change. So at the moment the test team they are down to nine players. And Rohan Brown again. German Bobby to jump deep. Michael German is giving uh, the Lakovia defensive unit a lot of problems. He's really playing hard today, is Michael German. And uh, we're on the stroke of half time. And uh, Jeffrey Henry on for Shamar German who had uh, that knock earlier. So he won't continue. So free kick now for the test team. Very dangerous area. Rohan Brown. And uh, that's Nicardo Simit. The goalkeeper is there and uh, take that one without any hassle. There goes the halftime whistle. 1-0, Zamaria Douglas. What happened on the... Here is Zamaria Douglas now. Ooh, and So Zamario Douglas has made it 1-0. Nice touch there from German Zamario Douglas in his stride. And uh, hit that one pass, uh, Legor in goal. 1-0, the Stets team lead with 10 players. So it looked as if Zamario Douglas, he had the winner against BB Coke when the Stets team were down to 10. Now he have done it again. So one nil the test team lead just after Christopher Roy had a was sent off. So the lack of a team now with the advantage, but they're down a goal. So Marquina Brown, second game, second consecutive game, second consecutive red card. This referee likes to give cards. But the, 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 the word has been spreading all over the Browns. And I'm sure it's all over on social media. Why didn't Campbell, number five for Lakovia, gotten a red card after he brought down Press, the Michael on, German on, he feedback. was the last player back come on, half -life feedback, and uh, come Marquino, on, half -life feedback, Brown, Marquino Brown Marquino Brown who Talk. that's a head when I own party do it at head that hello and welcome back to the sentence with technical sports complex second half action Stets leading this contest by a goal to nil and Zamaria Douglas the goal scorer the lack of the team to Campbell this is Dwayne Ball on to Webb number 14 and Rowan Brown are doing some defensive work. Here is Goldberg. This is the play. Free kick lock over. So second half action, just let me welcome you to Goldbuster Sports Note YouTube page. If you've joined us on this text YouTube page. So free kick here and Myers is over it. 
That's the red goalkeeper ball. And the Romel Wellington held that one really well. And uh, pretty much uh, the score remains at full time. Centres by technical, they will top the zone. They will top the zone. And uh, the Lakota team, they will be eliminated. Lakota team, they are on 10 points. They need this victory. They need this victory. They need this three points in order to stay a pole in contention. But the test team, they are resilient and will give you nothing too easy there's Nigos Daly that's nice move from Nigos Daly cuts on his right then he get that one across oh and that one is wide of target but wonderful work from Nigos Daly the youngster coming up from the ranks of under 16s and really making a good impression here for the eyes of Miss coaching staff Omar Rambo Woodburn Ball swung all the way across. Nigos Daly is there, Michael German, to catch all. And send with the header. Yeah, it's just an hmm? Chad, when you refer to him, Chad, go take yellow card. Since he gets the card, Alpha. And a team ball across. Alpha. The goal. The number nine I go to. I may reach a full. I don't make him time. He still can't score. The team day. They have to be disciplined. That's the main order of taking advantage of. The game that you you are upper man. So the sun is all out in his glory now. And uh, one o'clock kickoff. This is second half action. I am Goal Buster. This is Goal Buster Sports Note. And Lakovia, if you have just joined us, Lakovia in their blue and uh, sky blue. Now, here's a miss by uh, Campbell. And uh, Myers, number two, should have had a goal. Look as if he doesn't know what he wanted to do with the with the ball just now. So the Stets team, they have to be ready to defend the corner.
One nil. Second half action with Amaria Douglas in the 40, 48 minutes. At the front post, still alive, still inside the six yard, and uh, Trayvon Dunkley hit that one wide. So the Monroe team they have arrived. The BB Cope team they arrived the first. And if the game end like this, if this game end like this, the game between Monroe and BB Cope will be of academic interest. Even though the BB Cope team they, they were eliminated from Wednesday due to their 3 0 loss to Stets, they remain on 7 points. They, they only can end on 10 points. And uh, the Mono team they are on 12 points they lost to Lakovia on Wednesday but they are they are in good position to advance even if they lost to BB Cork today so the Lakovia team they came into this game with a must win situation now they're down now they're down The 10 player and Amigos Daily is still down. Myers, ball. And Myers going to keep that one in play. So the Myers is not, is not um, having a good game thus far. He's more a potent player than what we are seeing today. It's number two, Myers. A pretty much good service here at the Stets grounds. As I said, I gotta give it up to the grounds. Workers here at Stets have done well to keep this grounds on the construction. And the goalkeeper the goal rolled that one immediately out to Myers. One nil remains the scoreline. Ball, Dwayne Ball, Lakovia in possession. Going across field. The danger man. Jamal Wright. And uh, he watched close. Keen from uh, Captain Dante Campbell. First number, will you give me? Yeah. The same man. Look in your WhatsApp. Here we go. Nice turn there from ball. Good football. And a goal kick is the result. He was clipped. But none to the effect of a penalty. But good work from Dwayne Ball. Number 10, Lakovia. Where is the captain arms man? Sometimes, 
Zamari Douglas back over to Goldburn and if you if, if, if you haven't heard if you've just joined us the Stets team they are down to 10 players red card to Christopher Roy in the first half and the referee we have a word with the referee in the halftime interval and he said to me that it's persistent holding persistent holding he continues to hold the player after the player was in advance of attacking and he continued to hold the player and uh, that's the reason why he had to issue a red card while the while the infringement with Campbell and Michael German before that the referee says to me that the defender back was turned to his goal and Michael German was advancing but his back was turned to his goal so he wasn't facing the the ball so that's the reason why he, he got a yellow card that's Campbell <laughs> over for Mark Eno Brown in the middle of the park oral right is the second assistant first assistant is Michael Simon Pike there's Campbell and now the referee got to be careful can't let the game get out of control can't allow the game to get out of control the referee has to be careful got to be careful Mr. Ref have been doing a wonderful job in the first half you cannot allow and the both players gotten a yellow card as Zamara Douglas and number 10 Dwayne Ball so Zamara Douglas was test a yellow card and the Dwayne Ball for Lakovia in the referee's book Lakovia versus Stets the game on now BB Coat versus Monroe so Lakovia 10 points Stets 13 points and in pole position to go to 16 points Monroe 12 points BB Coat 7 that's the match in this group and a frustration to Dunkley but he has to realize that he's not leading so you have to be careful you're not in the lead here and you need to to win this game Yo, and I wish Claude your son. And I wish Claude your son. And I wish Claude your son. You can't do it. James, you can't do it. Well, inside the two ball miscontrol. Stets team playing with a lone striker in German. And here he is now. 
and he's uh, trying to do it on his own but I think that when he, he get the ball he should wait to see and to get help wait until the, his team step up Michael German should hold the ball get space and wait on his team to come forward to support so Javan Stone number four Lakovia you see by this evening, they're down, they need to win here in order to keep themselves or give themselves hope and chance of advancing to the interzone round, Monroe College. They are the closest they can get towards 16 round 13 points. Lakova can go to 13 if they get a victory here, but they're down a goal, but they're up a man. And, uh, the frustration keeps on there's a ball played a wide nice touch there from AJ Smith Zamari Douglas very sick player and uh, outside call. Here we go. Now here's a chance to go defending there from Row. And the German getting back to close the gap. Foul and Row. And uh, seems to be Nigos Daly. So Nigos Daly is still down. <laughs> Here we go. It's pretty much uncertainty in the second half, not knowing where and when a goal will score. First half was the ending of the first half was more electrifying. And the call holding one is from Webb. Now the lack of the team they they are hoping they are not showing any any form of pattern that they will use to form of pattern that they will use to 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 get the better of the test team but they are they have the advantage in, in players and if you're watching this I'm sure that if I didn't tell you you wouldn't know and it's testing they are down to 10 players and the team they're finding it hard to break down this testing So we're testing there down to ten players, nine players at the moment, with Captain Dante Campbell down on the sidelines there receiving treatment 
but he will get back in. Now a substitution coming in. You want next one thirty eight, you know ready? Yo, number thirteen. What I'm doing oh. So a attacking changer from the Lakovia team. Akeem Bennett is on and number thirteen row. Then our row is off. So a defender for an attacker. So coach Fitzroy Ambersley is going all out now to get back a goal. A water break. So welcome back to the center is better because sports complex. Free kick here for his test team. Dante Campbell is back on. And let me thank you again for making it all Buster Sports now. Stats there in the lead. Samara Douglas in the first half in the 40th minute. They're down to 10 players, but they look really well going forward. Handball call. So John and Blake is set to get in. Number 20, Sketch. Eagles Daily. Eagles Daily applied a great deal of pressure. He had a good game and uh, rightly so he was applauded off. So Jordan Blake, the slick looker player, and goalkeeper comes and collects. Slick looker player is Jordan Blake, number 16, is on for his test team. One nil. Ten players. So. There's a Rohan Brown calmly played that one to the left. And uh, after we give it up for Isa, who really st stuck to the task in uh, getting this schoolboy football 2021. Even though the pandemic is so strong, and if you realize that the stands are empty, so you have to follow the protocols of and ensure that you keep the coronavirus down, you can't allow it to rise. So Everyone have to wear their mask. It's a nice corner. Freaky corner. Goalkeeper Legor. But a beautiful corner there at the front post. Ajay Simic. And it's this team, they, they, are, they are winning the first ball. So, winning the first ball, that is what you want to see. And getting the first ball and the second ball. 
that will accumulate to possession, more possession. Rohane Brown not able to, to go forward because of the red card from because of the red card that Christopher Roy got in the 40th minute in the first half. Nice work there from Tyrese Stoddart. So this test team they are taking their own little time. Not giving the luck of the team any chance, any glimpse of goal. Still playing a high tempered game, still controlling the game even though they are down a man. And the coach Fixer Ambersley made one change which I think they need to he need to step up his uh, coaching abilities and uh, gamble some more while the state team they are holding their own state team also made a change in Jordan Blake like for like change Nigos Daly coming out and uh, attacking Farm. So two coaches against the against one another. Two coaches who who recently got their Concacaf coaching B license. In Omar Ramo Wedderburn and uh, Fitzroy Ambersey. Congratulations to both. So, free kick here for this test team. Tip off the head of Campbell, still inside the danger area. Donkey, we don't want to Myers. Myers back to Donkey. Chevan Donkey, ball. Over the top now, now here is a chance now. The goalkeeper comes and uh, nice goalkeeper there from uh, Romel Wellington. But Dante Campbell always there to stop the gap. Lakobe almost getting through just now find the equalizer should be a defensive header that wasn't a defensive header that was more of an attacking header by Captain Campbell offside call on that far side Well, I don't see the reason why Dunkley is doing that. <laughs> he's losing. He still, he's still holding up time. Come on, 
Come on, guys. Come on, Tom. Let me start ball complete. Brown recovers for this test team. And now the lock over team day. And a substitution coming in. Antoine. Number nine. So finally, Michael German can get some breather. And Antoine Simic, hard working, hustling striker. And no whistle on the play there. And uh, substitute collaborating there. And a yellow card shown to Simit, Ajay Simit, for that challenge on a goal burn. Nice work here from Stoddart. And the, the referee is, is, is making some calls that are not. Applicable. And then he's trying to make amends for the calls. The wrong decisions that he have made. He's trying to make amends for them. So we'll lock our team with a free kick. And a straight into the arms of Romel Wellington. Get up right and left and then me go. Come to your right, Romel. And Antoine Smith, player that knows what he's doing. And he has been draft in the honor 15, Jamaica honor 15. Recently. There he is, number 14, Antoine Smith. And uh, a player that is one for the future. And this team there holding on to this lead here. Ten players from the first half. That challenge and, uh, the player back was turned they see the decision and a Jamal Wright has been sent off so red card for Jamal Wright on a challenge on the Jordan Blake he was on a yellow card before 
from the first half and uh, now he's off so even Stevens here even Stevens for both teams and, uh, there's Raheem Brown over the wall and over the goal. So now, now they, this team can breathe a sigh of relief. Raheem Brown can. Step up now, and he is still at the back, not stepping forward at all. And referees, he's referee this game like it's not a contact sports, like he cannot touch a player. Because I see nothing wrong with that challenge just now, because the lock over player did not make an attempt to challenge. But yet still, the luck of the team, they, they got a free kick. Japan is strong. Now here's a chance now for the luck of the team. If Webb was more smart than how he is, he would have knocked that one over the top. Lobbed that one over the top, trying to catch the goalkeeper off his line because he already made that mistake. Roman Wellington and all Webb has to do had to do was to control and lob the ball over the top. But instead he tried to look for a pass. Responsibility is the main order of players, especially attacking players. You have to take your responsibility. Oh, that ball will swing in. And Alton Smith have a chance now to attack. He get around his player. But uh, Javon Stone is still there. Here's Antoine play that one inside now to Jordan Blake. Jordan Blake and first touch. Here's a shot now and they're saved by the goalkeeper. But Jordan Blake almost getting his first goal for his test team. And uh, that's intelligent from Campbell. The Mario Douglas. Second band, Maya, second band. Free kick here on Myers. On the park. Myers. Hey, very technical here, Alex Ball. Hey, very technical here, Alex Ball. Very technical here, Alex Ball. Ball swung for the chase of Antoine Smith. And Kevin Wright will get a chance to come in. And Davin Campbell, in fact, Dante Campbell, the man of the match for me, has been really fantastic. And the ball over the top there looking for 
Smith, Antoine Smith, but uh, accepted Lakovia. Now it's testing they regain possession. Later that one out to Rohan Brown. The Jibbers now. Later that one out to Smith. Then Smith get a better off Stone, but Stone is there. And really has done well. So the substitution can. Douglas, Samaria Douglas. Will come on and let that in. Right. We'll get in. And the, the <laughs> so the end of the game and that is the reason why the referee did not allow the substitution to, to come in so one nil sets over Lakovia full time Zamaria Douglas in the 40th minute and the Stets team they are safely through to the second round Lakovia, they were beaten and they were eliminated today. Monroe College on 12 points are also through. So the game, the next game, the Monroe versus BB Court game is academic interest only. And uh, the only cause is to play some good football in the next game. One row is through. Whether they lose or win on 12 points, they can go to 15. And uh, that's it for the first game from the St. Elizabeth Technical Sports Complex. So the final score. Stats 1. Lakovia, Nil.